Leak, leak on the beat, yo! What is up, everybody? This is Boy King of Burkhead, and I'm back with another video. As you know, if you're kicking the okay beat, it's hard, man. So, guys, we are on day 15, halfway there of Pride and everything. So, we got 15 more days until we're actually done with Pride. I ain't gonna lie, I'm... I'm a little bit almost happy that Pride is over because I'm um, doing this series and everything for Pride every single day of it. They were done it this long. I have seen YouTubers actually do videos like that, but as for with me <laughs> and stuff, more people who do that type of stuff, that's their full time job. I'm not at my goal yet to actually start getting paid for YouTube videos. So until that day, I'm still working. So I have to work around that. But anyway. We are here, and as you can see by the title below, we are talking about negativity, which is not the best thing to have. So you gotta get rid of that negativity, you know what I'm saying? So let's go and get into the topic. I hope that you're enjoying the series. Like, comment, subscribe, and comment down below rainbows and stuff like that for Pride Month and everything. And let's actually hop up into this topic. Okay, guys, so let's actually get into the topic. So negativity is basically just bad things that happens basically it could be just from circumstances circumstances that you can't control just life itself or either it can just be from a person who don't just spread just bad things which it could just be by words or just actions and stuff like that that is just negativity and negativity negativity just try to technically try to bring you down in all sorts of ways and stuff like that so you have to tell them like be Positive, think positive, do positive thing that gets you away from negativity. So let's actually hop up into this. So, <laughs> so negativity, um, negativity have been in my life. I'm not gonna say like everything positive has been through. Like there's nothing. There have been ups and downs with stuff I have grown up uh, with negative stuff. Just negative people around me, especially like in school with people try to be bullies. That's negative or just having bad days where you just feel like everything is not going your way and stuff like that. Negative stuff shouldn't control your life. Like everything you do, you have to control yourself. With the help of God and everything and stuff like that, you have he helps you have weight and you gotta finish the rest yourself. You gotta meet him in that middle point. You know what I'm saying? So when negative stuff gets you down, you always have to get some type of alternative. With me, I always turn to God when there's anything negative in my life or anything affecting me in my way and just talking to him and getting it off my chest actually feels better and so like that. I'm not going to say I have the best relationship with God, but I try my best to talk to him, keep him in mind every single day and just thank him for everything because I am blessed with what I have because I wasn't fed with a silver spoon. I had to work, work for everything that I have. I had to... No, go by off what my mom did or my brothers did, my like stuff like that. Like I was always have to work for everything for money for chores and stuff like that. I was never given anything unless I earned it. So yeah, so you gotta be appreciative. So when anything negative tried to affect my life and make me feel like I'm getting a little bit down, I was turned to God. God is my first person that I go to. If not God, then I go to my family. Typically that. Such as such. So, but I also do things that in positive ways actually just keeps me going and stuff like that. I just think, well, it could have been worse. Because so, honestly, like situations that happen, stuff that happened could have actually been worse. You always have to have a mindset. Like even, I say, if, okay, I hit my hand. Ooh, it hurts. But it could have been worse than that, you know. And it could be cut off. Like, no hand. Stuff like that. That's just an example. Like, you just can't let anything negative control your life, especially people. Because people are going to say what they say, but as long, it all depends on how you retaliate. Because one thing is, talking is cheap. Talk Anybody can talk. I can just say something about you. It all depends on how you take it. Everything shouldn't be taken so personal and stuff like that. I understand there are certain things that you shouldn't say or what you say, but it's to a certain degree. Like, someone can call me ugly and I was like, and 
It's all the way you spun. You can literally just walk away and you don't have to say anything. That's so that's a positive way to do it. Cause one thing get that avoid the negativity. Also, kill them with kindness. Kindness is the best thing to kill evil and stuff like that. Positivity and kindness. You cannot. You can defeat anything with that and stuff like that. So you always have to be in just positivity all the way through and so that. Now I ain't gonna lie. Like being positive is kind of hard sometimes because. It are all the stuff that can tick get on the edge of you, especially if you've been going through nothing but negative stuff all week or all day or something like that. Something small could set you off, but it takes the strength and the willpower to actually do what you want to do. So if most of the time for me, when I want to do something positive for myself, videos, seeing him do videos, it's just my way out just to talk it out in a way. Or play my video game because I'm putting all my stress and stuff in the video games like beating a level or beating an opponent or something such or stuff like that. Or either just you no know, listen to my music. Music makes me it's my vibe it's just vibe and everything. Putting my headphones in and dancing around and stuff like that keeps me going. And then just like I said, just thinking like it could be worse or just as that. Like you just have to kind of see it as that. That what makes it positive. Like even with YouTube videos. It's not going to lie. I have had negative comments. It's not not as big as I am. I have had negative comments. There have been comments about my coming out story. There have been negative stuff about the, people did, disliking stuff. And you don't even have to dislike it. That's negative. It's like you don't. It's there, but you don't have to push it. If you don't like a video, you can literally just click off of it or something like that. If you have an opinion, a bad opinion about somebody, you don't have to say it. You could just literally keep it to yourself. It all really depends on how you do stuff. Yeah. Like everything is just how you retaliate and so like that. I have lost subscribers based off what I post. If you don't like what I post, I did not make you subscribe. Literally, most of the videos that I start, like, if you even start from the beginning of my videos, I start with a coming out video. You know that I'm gay. If I'm gay, I'm gonna post gay stuff. Like, that's just me. My my videos are not set on one thing, not like food, ASMR, gaming, tech, like, stuff like that. My videos are based off of everything. And if honestly, if you don't like it, it's, well, I can't do anything about that. But I'd rather you look at my videos first before you subscribe, rather than subscribe. Then I make one video you don't like, and then poof, you're gone. That's the negative stuff. But like something like that doesn't discourage me, but I'd just rather you do it that way. But everything don't work out how you want to. So it is what it is. But yeah, like negative stuff, like it, it gets to you sometimes, but as long as you feel like you're a positive person or just do something positive and don't let that anger out and stuff like that, that's the best thing you actually can really do, huh? Open the door, bitch. I'm doing a video. Uh, no. <laughs> so Honestly, it all really depends on you. You just have the willpower. And like I said, like, sometimes it's hard. Do something positive. Just talking to them, someone could be best from not making your anger explode or get mad. Because, oh, someone said one little thing about what you did. Like, people could say, oh, I don't dress. I don't dress fine. Hey, this is my style. I like my style and everything. I don't really have a style. My style is just whatever I like. I literally, I'm literally right now wearing a pink shirt with black shorts and black and white shoes and stuff like that. My jewelry are always, well, I just got these cross earrings or just regular diamond earrings. I got my nose pierced. I change my piercing every now and then. And then I wear this watch I've been wearing since 2018. And then that's it. That's that's my style and everything. I gotta have some type of jewelry on my ears. My nose is pierced, so there's technically nothing going wrong with that. And then if this thing watch, this watch is faded. It's all that, but it's an accessory on my arm. Like that's just my style. But no one has said anything about it, but if someone do, it's like it's that's what I wear. I don't understand why you so worried about what I wear. Worry about what you got going on. But yeah. 
But honestly, I ain't gonna keep you up too much and everything. It's a little late at night, such and such. So that is day 15, halfway of Pride Month. And all that good stuff. So I hope that y'all enjoy it. Like I said, keep the negativity away. Nothing but positivity. And if you have negative stuff, by all means, I will not hesitate you. The comment section is there for a reason. The dislike button is there for a reason. If you feel that way, I have no problem with that. But it all, it really honestly not less necessary. All you gotta do is you feel like you don't like the video, click off. If you got an opinion, like I say, everybody got an opinion. So say what you say, go ahead and say what you say. But just know it's not gonna affect me because my intolerance Three years and stuff doesn't stuff don't really bother me that much, especially other people's opinions. So that's one thing that's not going to affect me. So yeah, but like I said, everybody just stay positive. Everything just keep this in here. Everything could be worse than it was. So just think of the think of this think of it as that. So um yeah, and I will see y'all next time because that's on period. <laughs> Bye guys, stay yourselves. Love y'all. Bye.